Hi everyone, uh, today we will learn how to fill blank cells in a pivot or a data set. So there are two options to do it. So we'll uh, get on to it. Uh, for the first option, we need to go onto the blank cells and click and right click on that. Once we right click, we go to field settings. Once we go to field settings, this window will pop up. We need to go to layout and print. Uh, after layout and print we need to click on this checkbox which says repeat item labels and click OK. So you see here all the uh, blank cells are uh, denoted by the uh, cell which contains value uh, above it. Similarly for the other column also we'll do a right click and go to field settings and go to layout and print and click on repeat item labels and click OK and it will also have the uh, blank cells filled with the above value. So that's how we do it uh, using option 1. The option 2, so if you have a pivot you uh, need to first paste special the pivot so to make it a data set. So we'll do a paste special value here. Once we do a paste special value uh, we need to select the range with blank cells. So we have these two columns where we have blank cells. We'll select this range. Now we will press Ctrl G. Once we do Ctrl G, this window will pop up. We need to go to Special. Then click on Blank and click OK. So if you see here, all the blank cells are highlighted. So you don't have to uh, click anywhere. You need to do this step very carefully. Do not click anywhere. Press, press the equal to sign and the above arrow. And then you need to press Ctrl enter. Once you do that, all the blank cells will be filled with the value in the above cell. So that's how uh, you do the, you fill the blank cells in a pivot or a data set. Thank you so much for watching and click on subscribe and uh, on the bell icon. Thank you.